I'm going to make another tutorial and this one is just to teach you on how you can uh, whiten your natural nails or your acrylic nails. If you are like me, you wear acrylic all the time, you know they are not going to be with their normal color. So um, one thing that you can do if you wear acrylic when you go to have your nails done, you can request uh, by uh, the technician to flush under your nails for you. So flushing is just the same machine that they use to clean your nails. What they do, they just put it underneath and they clean it because I hate when my nails are yellow. So there was a time I used to have my nails removed all the time and start from scratch because they would be so yellow. They just like, that's a pet peeve for me. I like to see them with their normal color. So now I know what to do when I go, I ask them to flush. So that's one thing you can just request to flush under your nails. And at the same time too, at home, you can just do your home, your own home remedy to uh, uh, make sure you whiten your nails. So let me show you the ingredients that you would need to do that. So I'm going to show you a lot of ingredients. That doesn't mean you have to use all of them at the same time. So I'm making this video. I'm incorporating everything together. That can be two videos or three videos, but since you know, I don't get paid for the video so i don't have to be greedy okay so i'm going to show you everything baking soda toothbrush toothpaste water peroxide lemon juice and you want a little container so i'm going to lower the camera so you can see all the items so i don't have to keep on raising and lower so at least you know so with the toothpaste that's the toothpaste this is the one that i have so that's the one i'm showing you it's not the big big brand name that all of us know so this is the one that i have and you bet your life if i don't have this one I don't have nothing at all believe me i can just use things inside my own house to turn into um a toothpaste so i can wash my teeth so names i don't kill myself too much for names if i have the name i'm happy if i don't have the name to whatever i have I, sh I, I i am satisfied and if i don't have this one i can compose things at home to make my own toothpaste so okay and this this one so I already put a little uh, piece of toothpaste right here. So what you can do with the toothpaste, you're going to mix the toothpaste with a little bit of baking powder, baking soda. Uh, that's too much. So I have it right here. So I'm going to mix it with the toothbrush. Okay. And the same way you brush your teeth, you're going to brush your uh, nails. Okay. So mix all together so it can turn into a, a big, like a mass. okay and what you do you know outside you don't have any problem the problem is under your nails you see what under my nails look like there was a time they were all yellow okay but because i do some work that's the reason why they look like that otherwise so you go like this okay and when you um do on your under your nails you if you are not busy i'm assuming if you are going to do that you have at least a few minutes for yourself because you cannot be doing it and be cooking rice and chicken or be cleaning fish it would not work because when you do it you have to make sure that you let your nails absorb um the baking powder baking soda and uh, the toothpaste for a little while 15 minutes the max and how you can do it if you have time you can do it every day if you don't have time you can do it when you can 
but you know the more you do it the better result if you do it today and you wait it again after three months it's not going to work so i have it right here under my nails you don't have to kill yourself too much for here but if you want to it won't hurt you can go like that and you go for those of you who don't have fake nails uh, you have your natural nails and your natural nails are yellow it it makes more sense to put this one right here instead of on the bottom but since you already have the mask it won't kill you so if you do right here you boss right here you can also make sure you boss underneath okay so that's one thing what we can do to um, help whiten our nails either with acrylic or natural nails and make sure you leave it for 15 minutes so that's one thing so now since i'm making the video i'm whiting okay but if i wasn't making the video i wasn't going to wipe but if you wipe to your nails already absorb the ingredients as long as you don't wash you should be good and another thing you can just have your nails soak with lemon juice so I have a little container that I fill it up with lemon juice because lemon juice is good for everything. So I pour a little lemon juice right here. And with the cotton swab, what you do, you wet the cotton swab and you can go like that. Okay. And underneath is very important. And with the lemon juice, the one good thing about lemon juice, a lot of people think if you put lemon juice on you, you smell lemon. You don't smell lemon. This one, you can go to sleep with it. You don't even have to rinse your hand. And if you do that as often as you can, you can just be going out. While you're going out, you put some lemon juice on your hand. When I'm going to work, you know i'm leaving i put lemon juice and after that and i just rub, you know put some nice victoria secret on my hand and i'm ready to go okay okay let's see here that that's another treatment to whiten your nails that's lemon juice and if you want to make a paste, okay, with lemon juice, what you can do, this one as well, baking powder, and this one you can make a batch and you put it in your fridge. Baking powder. okay and this one too if you after a while i don't need to make a bunch because i'm just making a video just to show you so that's the baking powder and the lemon juice this one you can just make a batch and you keep it in your fridge but the only thing and when you do it it's going to rise okay so do not put too too much because one time i did do that and it turned out to be so big i had to transport it to another container because it was way too big so make sure you pay attention to the container and you have to have a container that has a cover so you can just close it and if it stays for too long after a while it becomes extremely dry so uh, you can either try to do that every day you see as you can see i'm making the video look at this one will be enough for uh my baby my baby hands see because with a cotton swab once you wet you just go like that you fine so if you are the type of person you like everything to be ready you can just have it ready in a little container have it still and leave it in the fridge so every night you make sure you try to do that but if you have time 
and you know it doesn't take long just take a little teeny tiny bit of uh, baking soda and just pour some orange juice and you're ready to go and again once you do it 15 minutes would be ideal okay so and another treatment i think i already did this one it's the lemon juice okay so those are all the things that we can use to whiten our nails and if we are faithful we try to do that all the time and the, you know our nails will change color because i am a living proof i don't know for how long i have acrylic there was a time you know those nails used to be so brown that every time i would go I, I would love to start from scratch and they didn't like me you know they're making money but at the same time when they are very busy and i have to tell them to remove sometime it was and you know until i learned that i can flush i flush my nails every two weeks when i go and second i use my own treatment because i know what to do i try to make it by myself so now i'm much more satisfied i can only go and you know the place that i go to have my nails done my nails don't break so if one you know starting to grow kind of crooked just like this one it's a little bit now crooked because my nails are like that after a while you know they change shape so when i go i'm going to start from scratch with this one i'm going to tell them to remove this one because i don't like the shape but after that i don't have to worry when i go i just have my refill and i'm ready to go because my nails are not really yellow because they were extremely kind of brown so hopefully um this video will serve you well i gave you a lot of hints a lot of things you use toothbrush you use lemon juice you use uh, water peroxide you use baking powder and if you you don't have to use all of them i'm just giving you hints so if you use one if you soak your hands every day with um lemon juice you should be fine if you soak your hands every day with the water peroxide you should be fine if you use toothpaste and mix the toothpaste with uh, uh, baking soda you brush your nails just like you brush your teeth you should be fine or if you want to you can make a paste with baking soda and lemon juice and put it in the fridge you should be fine so i give you a lot of hints on how you can take care of your whitened nails it's either the virgin or acrylic nails so we know what to do now so we're going to take care of our nails so they no longer we are not going to have yellow nails anymore because we know what to do we are big girls okay thank you so much and this one is also for men too because some men you know have their nails done and some men have um base you know they put like clear coat on their nails so if you are the kind of men you have your nails done too and you have clear uh polish whatever you call it on your nails your nails can change color too so it can be suitable for men and for women okay and because a lot of men now you know they have their nails done and they put little things on their nails you know uh, uh, to make their nails look nice and shine and if you do it on a regular basis the same way we women our nails change color yours can change color too so it's like for everybody okay so thank you so much for watching you have a great afternoon keep me posted let me know what you think and if you know something that is much better than this one you can just send me a video you can send me some comments you take good care bye bye okay